Minimizing their impact and the disturbance while constructing roads and water crossings is an issue that Devon has devoted a lot of time and effort to. One innovation is a new use of material that is available naturally. It's either from the, the tops of the trees or from limbs that uh, don't get salvaged. So if the, the material, the wood that we're, we're taking out is salvageable and it goes to the mills, we'll take any of the waste wood and run it through a, a grinder to make the wood mulch. Okay, and this would just be laid over top of what's already there? Correct. Okay. Yes, so we'll, we'll take it and lay it over top of uh, the, the forest floor and, and, and try and keep the native soils in place. Don't see any, any kind there of are other options as well, like we this geocell road. So we'll, we'll place these over top of the surface, try to minimize the impact and, and fill these cups with either sand or gravel, wood mulch in some cases, to, uh, to make a, a road surface. Either a road surface or even a well site surface where the, the rig and, and other services will, will actually drive over. Being able to experiment with different construction materials here at the Evergreen Centre has made a big difference for Devon. It's just been a great area and like you say a lot of the, um, uh, I guess, innovations and, and trials that we've tried in the field we've, we've brought here to, to be worked on and as this, this uh, centre has grown it's now created almost like a, a palette, you know, for us to, to, to try different ideas. And, you know, there, there's no idea is kind of too off the wall. Um, you know, the other, other collaborators here and the other contractors that, that have supported this area, you know, really helped to, like I say, is to, 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 to throw some ideas out there and see if they're going to work. It's taking these new ideas and being able to try them out on a small scale that have led to these new solutions being implemented in the field.